Now, what we need to do is determine is this a geometric sequence or not. So what we need to do is, again, look at our ratios and determine, are we going to have a common ratio? So if I take a sub 2 over a sub 1, um, so I just kind of separate. These are a little bit off. But let's do a sub 2, which would be 16 over a sub 1, which is 32, which equals a sub 3 over um, a sub 2, which then equals um, a sub 4 over a sub 3, which then equals 2 over 4. And then what we can see is how can these reduce down to our ratio. And in this case, our ratio is a fraction, which would be 1 half. So yes, it does have a constant ratio, so therefore it is geometric. Okay, so you can go up and down. So um, yes, I guess you could look at it sometimes like that. You could say your ratio is a fraction.